Hi, this is Andy with Automated Marketer. In today's video, we'll be going over how to set up your domain inside of Go High Level. Let's get started. In this video, we're gonna go over how to add your domain to Go High Level. There are two ways to do this. In the first way, it's very, very simple. On services like GoDaddy or Cloudflare, it happens almost automatically. We'll show you that one first. And in the other one, if you're using a service outside of one of those two or others, depending on when you're watching this video, we're gonna show you the custom way to do it, how to add the records yourself. Either way works perfectly fine. And is actually pretty simple to do. So let's get into it. So there's a couple different ways to access where your domains are. You can go into sites on the left-hand side and click this cog right over here. That's one way to get there. Another way to get there is you go down to settings on the bottom left hand side and then you just go to domains. Now there's actually a third way to do it. If you have a funnel that you've been working on, you can just go into the funnel, go to settings, and you can click add edit domains right there. So I'm gonna use this one right now. So we click onto that and we always end up in the same place. And the first one that I'm gonna do is the automatic one. For this automatic one, I have it inside of my GoDaddy account. So I'm just gonna click on add domain and I'm gonna type in my URL. And I also want to add the www automatically so both will resolve to whatever funnel or website I'm building. And I'm gonna hit the blue continue button. Now it's going to search to see where the DNS records are. And in the moment, it's gonna notice, see, there it goes, that I am on GoDaddy. Since I'm on GoDaddy, this part is pretty simple. I just click authorized domain. It's gonna log into my GoDaddy account. Now it's gonna show my records. These are the records that are going to be added. I'm gonna just click connect. And then I'll hit close. It should take about 30 seconds and automatically it's going to add this domain to my account. Once it's added to my account, I can then choose the funnel that I'm going to use it for. And then I would choose the page that would be the in effect homepage and then just click link domain. And that's all there is to it to add your domain in the simple way to go high level. Now in the second way is not as easy, but not really that difficult either. So all I gotta do is click on this add button right here. I'm gonna put in my new domain. I'm just gonna type it in here. And I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna choose, I also wanna add the www record. And I'm gonna hit the blue continue button. Now what it's doing right now is it's finding what service I have my domain with. And because it's not on GoDaddy or Cloudflare, it's giving me the option to add the records myself, which is exactly what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna actually now go to Namecheap. Now that I'm on Namecheap, which is where I registered this domain, it could be Namecheap, it could be Bluehost, it could be any number of different services. You're always gonna look for the advanced DNS settings. So we're gonna click right in there and we're gonna see records right over here. Now this will work for all of them. All you gotta do is find out where you can add a new record. Now the records we have to add are an A record and a C name record. So we're gonna click add new record. I'm gonna choose A. I'm gonna put in the at symbol. I'm gonna grab this IP address and I'm gonna paste it right here. And then in this particular service, I'm gonna hit the green check mark. Now I'm gonna add my C name record. I click add new record. I choose C name. I'm gonna choose the www. I can just copy it with those two little boxes and I'm gonna paste it. And then I'm gonna copy this right over here. And this is the required value. And I'll paste it right here. And then all I have to do is hit the green check mark and it's automatically saved. Now this may take a couple minutes to resolve throughout the internet, but depending on the service that you're on, this should go pretty fast. You click over here and you click on verify records. And this could take up to 30 seconds. Now, sometimes it takes a little longer for the records to resolve. So we just wait a moment and then we'll click verify records again. But in the meantime, we can always go back and check to make sure our settings are correct, which they are. So because the internet sometimes takes time, this could actually take up to an hour. We're gonna wait a minute and then click verified records again. And as you can see, now it's resolved. I then use the same process as before. I choose a different funnel. I choose the homepage that I'll be using for that funnel and I'll link the domain. And that's all there is to it to add a domain to your Go High Level account. If you like this video and the content that we're providing, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.